Hello friends, this video on determinant part 3 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 and part 2 and this along the first row. So let me assume this is my matrix and I have to expand using first row. This is my first row. So the step is since I'm expanding using first row, let me pick the first element. The moment you pick the first element, just play a little more attention here because it's a little new for you. The moment you expand, uh, select a first element, you cross the elements which touches this number, row or column wise. So this number A11, you draw a straight line here and draw a straight line here. You cut all the numbers. You will get a 2 cross 2 matrix. Correct? We can find determinant of this. Very simple. We have done this. So what we can do? Once we are done with this, so, so we can say that we have to find this guy first. Once we are done with first element, what we can do? We can select the second element. Here also, let's cut these elements that is draw horizontal line and vertical line which touches this element again here if you see the four elements remaining that is also a two cross two matrix the third step will be take this guy again draw horizontal line and vertical line cut these elements so you get again a four element matrix you find determinant of all these multiply with these numbers and add and you will get the determinant of the whole 3 cross 3 matrix. I will tell you why, how. So the step is, this is let me say step 1, this guy is step 2 and this guy is step 3 and I will add all the values which I get in all the steps. So let me say output of step 1. See first step was to select the first row so I will mark it as 0 step. So that is my, I just selected my first row because I am using the first row to find the matrix. So the rule is you say minus 1 to the power, I will write here, minus 1 to the power i plus j a i j into the, the matrix which you get, 2 cross 2 matrix. So in this case minus 1 to the power i plus j. i is 1, j is 1 because this is a11 which I selected. So minus 1 to the power 1 plus 1 into aij that is a11, a11 this multiplied by the, the matrix which you got here that is a22, a23, a32 and A33. So this is my output of step 1. Similarly, output of step 2, same thing minus 1 to the power i plus j. Here i is 1, j is 2, 1 plus 2, a i j that is a 1 2 and the matrix which we got here. So this is a 2 1, a 2 3, a 3 1 and then we have a 3 3. So this is my second output. Similarly, I will give output from step 3. Same thing, minus 1 to the power i plus j. i is 1, j is 3, 1 plus 3. a i j, a 1 3, correct, a i j. Now the matrix which you have got, a 2 1, a 2 1, a 2 2, a 3 1 and a 3. So this is the output of step 1, step 2 and step 3. 
so what is this determinant of a or a or triangle all are same is nothing but add all output step 1 step 2 step 3 whatever you got just add it so this becomes i just simplify this further here because i don't have space here minus 1 to the power 2 is 1 1 into a11 is a11 and this guy becomes multiply diagonals subtract the remaining part a22 a33 minus a32 a23 correct this guy minus 1 to the power 3 is minus 1 into a12 is minus a12 multiply diagonals a21 a33 subtract remaining part a31 a23 similarly here also same thing minus 1 to the power 4 is 1 1 into a13 is a13 into multiply diagonals a21 a32 minus subtract remaining part a22 a3 so this is what i get so let me add all as i told this is nothing but add all output so what i will get is a11 into a22 a33 this one minus a32 this guy into a23 a 2 3 correct minus why minus because i am adding this so plus minus to become minus a 1 2 this guy a 2 2 a 3 3 minus a 3 1 a 2 3 plus this guy have to add a 1 3 into A two one, A three two minus A two two, A three. Now let me arrange this guy. So let me arrange in this fashion so that A one one comes first, and then A one two and A one three. So A one one is in this element and this element. So let me write that A one one, and second element will be A two two. This guy is A two three. So this guy will come first. Just arranging it. Just for convenience, a t two a three, the first element minus a one one, a two three, a three. This guy. I just arrange in this fashion a one two three like this a one two three. Correct. Now the second will be a one two element. So a one two is this guy. Correct. A one two. And then I should have two two this guy. Correct. This is yeah. two two one only. Yeah. So this guy will become minus. I'll take this guy a one two. This becomes a one two into a two one a three. Again minus minus plus, so this become plus a one two a two three. I'll just because I'm arranging it a three. Why? Because I'm arranging in this fashion one two three one two three just for convenience. Now the third a one three element, this guy a one three into a two one a three two minus a one three. A two two, A three. So this is the determinant value I got. This is the value I got. So this is my determinant of A, and that is my answer. Correct. So to so getting determinant is you take the first row. This is what I have done till now. You take all the elements one by one in the row. cut off the elements which lies in that horizontal or vertical line for that particular element you get two cross two matrices use the formula minus 1 bar i plus j into aij and that matrix itself you get three output add all the output you get the matrix 
Now we have to prove that you expand along any of the row or any of the column, you get the same answer. So till now what we have done, we expanded this along row 1. Let's expand this along column and see if the result is same or not. So let's do this. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.